Say hi. Say hi. Bruh. All right, got them all boxed up. Man, a lot of work. Check it out. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And um, I screwed up on two, so I had to cancel the order. So I would have had 11 sales in uh, three days, because I usually don't go any further than three days. So that's pretty good. Good for me. Um, yeah, pretty cool. Say hi. Say bye. Say goodbye. Bye. Take it easy. See you later. Hey, before I forget, oh yeah, I had a couple notes. Um, what was it? Oh, um, yeah. If anybody's interested in a dynamo, woo. I got one. It's um, Dynamo Label Writer 450. Some rat sold it to me on Facebook. It's a European model. and only takes European labels. Uh, yeah, I know. Uh, I probably got six hours jerking around that piece of crap trying to figure out how to use it. And the only problem was it was the wrong labels. Just have to buy Labels specifically made from, made for a European model, not the American model. So, anybody's interested, I'm into it for 120 bucks. Yeah. Make me an offer. I don't care. It's got to go. I, I'm done. I'll just use my printer. Um, there's that. And, oh yeah, do me a favor. Hit the, um... Subscri uh, yeah, subscribe button if you haven't already, and the little um, bell icon to notify you with uh, a ding if I do another video. It is 2 o'clock Monday. I am exhausted. I'm done. I've been working like seven day weeks uh, for as long as I can remember. I'm going to go in. Have a good day. Hey, it's March 3rd. Um, I got a bunch of sales this week. Um, this is probably what over the last three days, I guess. I like to get stuff out like every three days or so. So, what do we got? We got, um, <laughs> this is eBay. Sold a knee brace. You really can't see it inside the bag, but that's sold. I've had that laying around for a while. Brand new. Um, Sold for 11 bucks plus $9 shipping, going to Brooklyn, New York. Um, got these. Let me show you. Uh, oy, where are we here? eBay, eBay, eBay. Um, hmm. This is... I don't know what's sold here. This knee brace thing. Um, yeah, it was brand new. It wasn't in a box, but it was in a bag. Um... I got, I took a best offer of like, I don't know, $7 or something. Guy cried. He fell off his bike and he needed a, a brace and had no money and blah, 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 blah. So these set of four Rosanna Peristyle Fashion 8 inch dessert plates. Yes, they are sold and gone. Sold them for 16 bucks, $10 shipping. Um, they've been laying around for a while. They're going out to Springfield, New Jersey. This guy, this is actually my old wrench I used to use. Um, it's an aluminum pipe wrench, rigid. Really, you can see I used to use it. I beat the crap out of everything I own. Um, got 20 bucks for it. That was a best offer. 780 shipping. Got the Bud Light. Oh, and that's going to Spencer Port, New York. Um, and a Bud Light, kind of rough condition, but it is what it is. Um, again, another best offer, $25, $9 shipping. Going out to Staley, North Carolina. Um, one of the things I can't find is a round glass shade. Um, they're not going to be happy today. 
this thing. I found this in a pile of other patches. Um, I just thought it looked kind of cool. It's Burt Reynolds Horse Ranch patch. So I looked it up and found out they're pretty expensive. Um, what do we got? 1760. That was a best offer off of 20. And shipping is $13. It's going in a regular envelope, but it's going to Bucking, Buckinghamshire, UK. Um, it's got a hell of a long trip ahead of itself. Um, what else? This thing I have had laying around for a long time. And um, he was a slow pair. Took him almost 10 days to uh, send me a payment on that thing. I had to open up a case against him. But he had some problems. So it's resolved and he bought it. 15 bucks plus $9 shipping going out to Reedsville, North Carolina. Um, and that's it for Etsy. I got, I sold two of the brown tin panels. They're over here. Look at them all. I think I've got about 30 of them. Uh, dented. These are decorative panels. I used to put them in uh, countertops or backsplashes and stuff. Um, they measure 10 by 10. Sold two of those. 31 bucks for the pair. $15 shipping going to Fredericksburg, Iowa. Got a lot of uh, Florida postcards. How many? 22 Florida vintage postcards. 21 bucks. And uh, six dollars shipping going to Port Orchard, Washington. And last but not least, some milk glass horse head shaving mugs. They're not exactly the same. One's a little, a little more see-through than the other. Uh, they went for thirty bucks for the pair. Nine seventy shipping going to North Cumberland, PA. And that's about it. I'm going to box these up um, and get it done. Uh, I'll talk to you later. See you. Yeah, you know, this is what I do. Um, man, you know, I'll be up late at night sometimes doing listings. And um, I forget to put the location. It's like I did in the last two. Just sold this thing. You know, 31 bucks for it. It's not bad. I don't know why this thing. Hmm. Hold on a minute. Hmm. Oh, well. Man, you really got to close with this thing. It's the GoPro Hero, whatever. Yeah, 31 bucks. It's a uh, bartender's friend. Um, shaker. What is it? Vintage. Barkeeper's friend glass cocktail shaker with lid. Uh, lid and recipes. There's recipes for some old time drinks on the side of it. It's pretty cool. But here's my, my, my description. And usually right at the end, right there, that's where I put the location of the item. So that when I need to find it after I sell it, I'll know where it is. Hmm. Guess what? I can't find that damn thing. I've seen it a dozen times and <laughs> it's here somewhere. <laughs> I really need to find a better system. Um, I don't know. I've seen guys <laughs> on YouTube. Um, they have no numbers. I mean, this I have the shelves are numbered. And it gives me a pretty good idea of where everything is. But, uh, holy crap, there's guys out there. They just pile everything. You know, it looks like that with no filing system whatsoever. You know, this I have labeled as center shelf because it's in the center of the room. And these bays, even though our bins, even though they do look pretty crappy, they're labeled. Um, normally. I have a uh, location listed in the listing. So, I don't know. 
this is gonna be fun. You know, like I got nothing better to do than hunt down stuff because I forgot to put friggin' location on it. Ah, man. You know, well, at least I know I have this one. The last two, I don't have. So, I have some pissed off customers. Hopefully Etsy isn't the same as eBay. When you pull that too many times and you cancel orders because you screwed up, they put you on the shit list. And um, do it too many times, they'll suspend your account. They took me off the power lister uh, status. Not that it means anything at all. But it gives you, you know, you're in good standing. And uh, now, you know, and I was above standard. Because I screwed up twice. Um, they took my power listing thing off. And uh, now I'm below standard. <laughs> I get all my listings out on time. I don't, I, you know, I screwed up twice. And they pull all that crap. <sighs> I don't know. All right. Hopefully I'll find this thing and uh, I can get back to work. See you.